Hi everybody, it's Annie Mazmanian from Amazing Sense by Annie, Independent Sensing Consultant. Thank you for joining me and welcome to my amazing channel. Hey! All right, so today I'm going to be reviewing and revealing the new Sensi Summer 2020 collection. Oh, I'm so, so excited that this finally came in and that I get to finally share it with you all. However, I am so, so sorry. A lot, a lot of these products have already sold out or on back order, or I think they've just all sold out. The good news is there is some available still to add to your Sensi Club, if that's what you're interested in. So stay tuned. It's quite a collection if you're not familiar with it already. There's a lot here on my desk that I need to share with you all, but it's going to be worth it. I promise. All right. So I don't even know where to start because literally the summer collection had Scentsy pods, had Scentsy bars, had Scentsy oils. We've got flowers. We've got laundry. We've got the body line. We've got clean line, scent circles, and we've got two beautiful warmers, which I'm sorry, I'm going to save till the very end. I haven't even opened them yet, and I want to open them with all of you. So why don't we start with, I guess let's start with the Scentsy Bars. Do you want me to start with the Scentsy Bars? <coughs> Excuse me. So there was five Scentsy Bars that came with the Scentsy Summer 2020 collection, and they are... I don't know, delicious, can I say? They are beautiful. I'm just gonna say they're amazing because that's my that's my word. But there's five of them. They're lovely colors, like a little rainbow, and I'm just gonna start sniffing with them. I'm sniffing them with you. So the first one is watermelon tangerine. Now this one is described as sweet watermelon slices spiked with juicy tangerines and dewy greens. So let's see. Oh, you know what? The scent reminds me of something else. Have you guys smelt these yet? If this one reminds you or is similar to another scent, please comment below. But you can definitely smell, I'm going to say you can definitely smell the watermelon. It's not as strong as like, uh, like a pure watermelon. I'm trying to think of a watermelon scent right now. Was it watermelon wave or anyways, but, um, it's definitely got the watermelon and the tangerines. In regards to the dewy greens, there is something earthy about this. It's not overly sweet. It is sweet, but not overly sweet. Does that make sense? Ooh, it is really pretty. And again, it's a lot lighter on the sweet factor. There is definitely the watermelon and the tangerine. And it, I think it's a good combination of the both. And then there's this like undertone of this earthy scent to it. So that's probably the dewy greens. So we got watermelon tangerine right here. Next is called Fiesta Lime. And this one is fun loving lime, lemongrass and ginger throw the ultimate block party. Oh, I miss my block parties. <laughs> oh, and that is if you love lemons, lime, lemongrass, all that citrusy scents, you are gonna love Fiesta Lime. But it, I like it because you can really smell the ginger. Normally, when things have ginger in it, I, I find that they're not too strong. Like, I don't smell the ginger as much as I would like to. But the lemongrass, the ginger, is really, really strong. Like, a good combination of all three of them. Lime, lemongrass, and ginger. And it's so, it's almost sweet. That must be like maybe the ginger. Is ginger kind of sweet? Anyways. But... There is almost like a sweet factor, but it's more on the citrusy scent than the sweet. Does that make sense? All right. If you like your citrus scents, lemons, lemon verbena, lime verbena, whatever, get this one. All right. Next is Palm Beach Breeze. And this one is described as flamingo peach struts over lush palm greens and a hint of salty ocean musk. Hmm. Oh my gosh. This is such... Oh my gosh, Scentsy, make this into a perfume or a lotion. Oh, it is so pretty. So you can definitely smell the peach. You can smell something floral. Must be the lush palm greens. And then there is something fresh about it too. Something like, like the salty ocean musk. Something fresh. But yet, isn't musk? Musk is more of like an earthy tone, I find. I don't know what, what even scent category I would put this in. I think I would put this in more floral. To me, I smell a lot more um, floral scents as opposed to maybe the peach or the fresh ocean scent or that musky scent. 
But it is a really, really, oh, that is really pretty. That is a really, really pretty scent. And stay tuned because actually this scent also comes in a laundry bundle. So I'll get to that one in a second. But Palm Beach Breeze is probably my favorite so far. It's so pretty. Okay, next is Pineapple, Pineapple and Fiego. <laughs> All right, so this one is described as pineapple nectar and sugar cane get fired up with a dash of sriracha. Wow. Oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh. This is all pineapple. I'm sorry. This is so pretty. So pretty. So sweet. I love it. Oh, my gosh. It is pineapple, sweet pineapple. Think pineapple with, like, sugar on top, and then you grill it. Because there is that, like, it must be the sriracha. There, for some reason, there's like this, I don't know, there's this like weird scent. I don't, I don't mean weird. You know what I mean, right? But like there's this different undertone. And for me, when I smelled it, it, it reminded me a little bit about, about grilled vegetables or because I know Nathan puts, he loves uh, hot sauce. Me, not so much, but um, he loves the sriracha. And that's like when the sriracha meets the barbecue. Now I'm probably painting you like, oh, that sounds really weird, <laughs> like burnt sriracha. No, that's not it at all. I can't even describe this one, it, but it is mainly like 99%, 98% pineapple, and then 1% sugar. Okay, maybe 5% sugar. And then there's this like 1% of something else at the bottom of it, but it is so sweet. I would definitely put this in the fruity category. So last but not least is called hibiscus water. And this one is described as apple and hibiscus frolic in a mellow mineral water spring. Oh, something keeps popping up on my screen. Okay, so hibiscus. Oh, you know what? Oh my gosh. This one smells, I'm trying to look back to see if I have that bar. It smells like something else as well. <laughs> oh, but it's really pretty. You can smell a little bit of the apple, but mostly, I, I find that it mostly smells florally but there is that freshness to it if that makes sense i would almost think of putting this in the fresh category oh mineral oasis i think it kind of smells a little bit like mineral oasis but sweeter oh that's really pretty actually all right so hibiscus water so those are the five summer scents yay and again they're still available to add to your scentsy club if you're not familiar with Scentsy Club, you can visit me online at amazing02.scentsy.ca. If you're from America or any other country other than Canada, you need to switch over the little Canadian flag to the American flag before you start shopping. However, if you're interested in starting a Scentsy Club, just go to the Scentsy Club tab and read all about it. And it's it's really, really an amazing program that they have. You can have stuff shipped to you every month, every other month, or every third month, and you can cancel at any time. So, you know, if you didn't get these bars, add them to your Scentsy Club and have a sniff of them when they come next month. All right? Okay, so moving on. Uh, so all five bars also came in scent circles. I just wanna show you them. I love the color, the color theme of this collection. It's just so pretty, and I'm a big girl. I love big girl on um, rainbows. I love rainbows, I love my unicorns. So this is totally like smell the rainbow. So we got all five scent circles that my lovely hostesses and shoppers are going to be receiving it also so also we have pods scentsy pods now they didn't come in all five of the scents i'm not quite sure how they decided how to pick which pods are going to make the cut or which which aren't i would definitely love to see palm beach palm beach breeze as a scentsy pod and i think the watermelon tangerine okay well that would be all of them but so <laughs> We got Fiesta Lime in a pod. Mm -hmm. And remember, the pods are great for your Scentsy Goes, for your Scentsy Mini Fan Diffusers, and the Wall Fan Diffusers. And there's two of them that come together. You don't necessarily always have to use two. You can use one, and you can totally mix and match. So the next one is the Pineapple and en Fuego. I'm so sorry if I'm saying it wrong. I'm so, so sorry. And again, oh, all pineapple. All 100% Pineapple, that's all I'm smelling. And hibiscus water. Again, some fresh floral, I think there's, yeah, fresh and floral. It reminds me a little bit about Mineral Oasis. Okay, 
and what else okay so oh we also got two scent scentsy flowers fragrance flowers i love the box i love how pretty and colorful it is right i don't even want to take it out of the box i don't even want to give them away or give them back to their customers but look how beautiful they are so the flo the flowers only came in two scents one was the pineapple and fuego and the other one was hibiscus water so again not sure how Sensi decided on which scents are going to be what products but i would have loved to see more in the Sensi flowers but these ones are still beautiful so i'm just going to leave them in their package and just to share with you that there were two brand new scent Sensi fragrance flowers also, we got the, my favorite scent, Palm Beach Breeze in the Washer With. So it was a laundry bundle. So you got two Washer With uh, mini tubs. I call these mini tubs. They're 16 ounces or 454 grams. Love it. And it came with the laundry, the liquid laundry as well. So, and check out, oh, it's, a, mm, it's just so such a pretty pretty scent to uh use now i tried adding this to my scentsy club now please uh inform me down below i thought with scentsy club you can add anything even like even the limited edition washer whips or the limited edition pods but when i went in there to edit my scentsy club i didn't have that option so I guess not, right? But please comment below, let me know. I just was under the impression with Scentsy Club, you could add pretty much everything. So yeah, okay, so moving on, we've also got a counter cleaner and dish soap in the Fiesta Lime. And how amazing are these? Because I love, love that lime scent. It reminds me a little bit about Squeeze of the Day in regards to the citrusy lemon scent. But I love that these two came out in the collection. We also have some body stuff that came out in the two scents of watermelon, tangerine, and hibiscus water. So we have our fragrance mists here, Scentsy Fragrant Mists. And then they also came in hand soap in both scents. And they actually also came out with body sugar scrub. So I only received the hibiscus water. I believe the watermelon tangerine sugar scrub is on back order, so it'll eventually come. But this one, I don't know. I can't really open it, I guess. Yeah, but these are beautiful. I, I would love to see these in the regular, like everyday Scentsy collection, the, the salt scrubs, because they work really, really well. Oh, I can't put the lid on. <laughs> So again, we have it in hibiscus water and watermelon tangerine. It's just on back order. So, but you gotta check out the mists if you happen to get them. So now I'll share with you the State of Bliss Scentsy Oil three pack. So this was the summer of 2020 oil collection. I love how they have all these oil collections coming out, including the Father's Day one. So I love this little tin, it comes with a little flyer inside that describes each of the three scents. So we've got, the first one is called Lemon Dragon Fruit. So this one is described as tropical dragon fruit and exotic papaya are infused with a tangy twist of sun-kissed lemon. Mm. Okay. Oh, I would like that in a bar. Oh my gosh, that is so pretty. And I love these like little bottles. They're just five mil bottles. Mm, oh my gosh, I could like use this up all in one, all in one day, just dump it all into my diffuser. This is okay. So you're okay. You're like, stop talking, talk about the scent. All right. So definitely the papaya, definitely the dragon fruit. Although I find dragon fruit and papayas. Um, are very similar or actually dragon fruit doesn't have too much of a scent I find but papaya definitely papaya and then there is that citrusy scent as an undertone but I would put like papaya and lemon as like the top the top two notes Ooh, but it's so pretty all right going on is called dewberry guava oh no that's that one so dewberry guava is described as tantalizing guava puree and Dewberry get an extra kick of candied strawberry sweetness. Okay, let's try. Mm, oh my goodness. 
Okay, it's all strawberry. I don't know. What's dewberry? Ooh, and guava. Yeah, you got that guava guava scent. It is really sweet. It is really, really like sugary, almost kind of like a candy cane-like sweetness. Not candy cane, um, cotton candy. So you've got the guava, you've got the strawberry, and then maybe the dewberry is that undertone, but it is very sweet and fruity, whereas maybe the lemon dragon fruit is more on the citrus side. So there we go. And the last one is called cucumber white tea. And that one is described as fresh cucumber slices drift over a tranquil blend of green and white tea. Oh, I love my green teas. Oh, that is, you know what? That's a really light scent. It almost reminds me of aloe water cucumber in regards to the, to the lightness and the kind of the freshness. That is so pretty. So definitely you can smell the cucumber. And I was almost, I was gonna about to say like, you can smell a little bit of almost green apples, but that's probably the green and white tea. Ooh, but it's a really light scent and it is on the sweeter side, but lightest of the three for sure. All right, so who's ready for the warmers? You're like, yes, finally. Oh, and it comes in this adorable little tin. It's already ready to be like wrapped up, put a bow on it and give it away. <laughs> All right. Check that out, so cute. Okay, so we've got a night light. It's called Frond of You. And then the warmer, both are the same design. The warmer is called Tropical Paradise. Oh, I'm so, so excited to open these. I almost wish I bought more of them because I'm sure my kids are gonna love these. So uh, let's do the night light first. I'm gonna start off with the smallest because I have a feeling that warmer is gonna be wow the wow factor all right so just so everybody knows it's 120 volts 60 Hertz and all Sensi mini warmers require uh, a 15 watt Sensi light bulb don't go to your local hardware store and pick up any little Christmas tree or Christmas light bulb you got to contact your Sensi consultant for these because these are special light bulbs almost magical they warm up to a certain temperature so that they can gently melt the wax and regular light bulbs, they don't do that. <laughs> All right, so here we go. Now this is a glass warmer, glass night light. Oh, wow. Look at how pretty this is already. <gasps> oh, I love the rainbows. I love the palms. So pretty. So we're just gonna twist it right in. This will look even pretty on a tabletop base. Wow, as opposed to uh, plugging it into the wall. Let's see if this plug works. Oh yeah. Okay. <clears throat> All right. Now I know it's hard to see because the room is really, really bright, but I guess you can get the gist of it. How beautiful would these look at nighttime though, sitting in your bathroom? <gasps> How gorgeous. I love it. And then here it is off. It is just as beautiful. Oh, Sensi, I hope you bring these back. I know they sold out super, super quick. So for those of you who did not get one, I'm so, so sorry. But I'm praying that maybe they'll come back in like spring, summer catalog of 2021. How cool would that be? Hey, get your Sensi ideas in there because you never know, Sensi will listen. All right, so before instead of me packing all this up and you waiting, why don't I just move it over to the side? There we go. And let's open up the beautiful warmer. Okay. So tropical paradise. Here it is. Oh, you probably want to know the specs. Okay. 120 volts, 60 hertz, and 25 watt light bulb. Don't forget to get the light bulb from your consultants. <laughs> All right. So here's probably the dish. Ooh, so it's kind of this like mossy green, mossy green dish. And yep, yeah, no more than four cubes of wax at the time. At a time, we don't want any spillage. All right, let me just move that over. Oh, look how beautiful it is. Oh, okay, I'm getting so excited. <laughs> All right, oh, where's the light bulb? Did they put it in there somewhere? Here it is. Oh, 
All right. Real life, baby. <laughs> Come on. Let's go. All right. Light bulb. Yay. So gently screw in the 25 watt Scentsy light bulb. There we go. And we're going to put the dish on. How beautiful is this? Now, I find this one more pinky, pinky, you know what I mean, than the nightlight. Remember the nightlight? You could see, like the top half, you could see a lot of the blue and the greens and the gold. I find with this one, it's more like, it's more pinky and there's some gold up at the top. There's a little bit of blue, but not like this one. But it's still so beautiful and so unique. I love the flower design or the plant design. All right, let's plug this one in and show you. Let me make a little table out of the box so it's high enough for the camera. There we go. Okay. Oh, it didn't come on. <laughs> oh, there, it must be my extension cord again. How beautiful it is. Wow, so it's not very bright. There we go, off and on. And when it's turned on, I find that it is more like pinky and gold. There's some blue at the bottom. Oh, this is so beautiful. Oh, you know what? I can't wait to see what this looks like in the dark. And maybe I'll do like a quick little like Instagram video about what it looks like in the dark. How beautiful is that? So speaking of Instagram, I'm on Instagram. I'm also on TikTok and Facebook. Please, please shoot me a like and follow me. But in regards to YouTube, don't forget to hit like and subscribe. Leave me some positive comments down below. I'd love to hear your thoughts on this Scentsy Summer 2020 collection. Who is hoping to see this one come out in the 2021 collection? Oh my gosh. I hope it's in the catalog. It is so, so beautiful along with this one. I love the like the matching sets. I think it's so cute. But yet it's different, right? Because this one has like just strictly the palm leaves, whereas this one has more of a tropical uh, plant selection, I guess. So yeah, I think that's it. Hopefully you enjoyed this video and you learned something. I'm so, so sorry again that all of these are pretty much all sold out on our uh, websites. They went really, really fast and then they took a while to come because of, because of everything. So, but you know what? Stay tuned. Um, you never know what might come back out of the vault or or whatever. So yeah, thank you everybody for watching. Don't forget to find me on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. Shoot me a like and subscribe. And you can always find me online at amazing02.sensi.ca. Again, if you're not from Canada, no problem. You can join my team as well. There's always, always room for you. And how awesome would it be to, to start this amazing journey with me? All right, everybody. Thanks again and be well. Bye for now. Mwah.